guys welcome back to my channel today my daughter is with me giving you guys this intro for my newest project pan that i'm doing um this project pan is going to be the a to z yeah let me put my page here um a to z project pan so you pick one product for every letter of the alphabet so i have 26 products and this project um, is a year-long project so it starts today which is the first the day that I'm filming this and then ends December 31st so 26 products in a whole year is um, I feel like not too too much to do um, this will be monthly updates so I'll give you guys updates every month um, so let's go ahead and get into the pro products Jessica do you want to hand me the first one Okay, the first product for A is Air Repair um, Facial Mist. I believe this is like a setting spray or just like a mist for your face um, throughout the day. So this is for A, and I have used some of this. I'm not really sure where it's at, so I will I will definitely mark everything um, once I'm done with the video so I know where I'm starting at. So this is for A. Okay, next. Um, B is going to be the NYX Liquid Suede. Uh, it's like the shade is Brooklyn Thorn on this. This is, I believe, one of the newer shades that I've gotten. Mm -hmm. And you, you definitely cannot tell um, because the packaging is not see-through. You can't tell where your progress is on this. So yeah, we yeah, are just yeah. going yeah. to wing it on that yeah, one. Next. C is Cla Claudel. Um, this is a moisturizing, like lotion type thing. So um, this is like just a daily moisturizer that I will be using. So that is for C. Next is D. Um, this next one is Derma a Derma E product. This I believe I got in a influencer box. Um, this is the overnight peel. Um, you put this on before you go to bed at night. So this is just like a little sample size of it. E is for this Elf Story Chapstick. So let's pull it up and see how much I have left. Don't want to do all the way. And this looks like it's pretty new. So it's a fairly new product. I don't think I've used it a lot. Probably just a couple times you see that it's uh, domed up the top there so I will definitely mark my my progress on that one okay, no. next is F this is in the covergirl true naked nudes palettes um, this is in the shade fawn to be this shade right here this brown shade is what I'm going to be using so that is going to be good for um, like a transition shade or an outer outer corner shade so G Jeez. is the INT cosmetics this is a single shadow in goddess gold this is in my um, color pop Z palette so this is the product right here this is a pretty pretty big pan so I I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to use this up by the end of the year. Is the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Mascara. Mm -hmm. um, it, it says it's a plumping mascara. So I was um, I was at Target a couple days ago and seen this. And I was like, oh my goodness, I have to try this. Um, and see if it actually like plumps my lashes. So that is that one. Mm -hmm. I... Is yep mm -hmm, is going to be a pocket back from Bath and Body Works. This is the I I'm really a mermaid. So that is what I'm going to be using. This is brand new. I haven't even used it. So mm -hmm. there is that one. Small. Next one is for J, and it is this Juju Volcanic Ash Facial Mask. This seems really really cool show them the back okay all right so that is for j that is many as you can do 
And Next is K. So this one is um, a bath bomb. Instant kiwi and Mom, strawberry. Can, can I, so this? I know I will definitely be able to use this. So. What? This is L. Okay. L. And this is from the Tardiest Pro Glow Palette. Open it. I got this, um, I want to say like around my birthday. I haven't really, and that was May, and I haven't really used it much. Which shade are we using? So we are using the shade Lit, which is this one right here. Um, I want to try to use it up. If not, try to just hit pan on this shade. And it is a highlighter. Yeah, highlighter. Yes. It is a highlighter. Uh, so next is for M. And this is this Maybelline Master Fix setting powder. Yeah. Um, I do already have this currently in a project pan. Um, this is my progress. This is like slow moving because I I use just a little bit every time I do my makeup. I put that underneath my um, underneath my eyes to set my concealer, and that's the only thing I use that for. So I might have to try to use that for my whole face just to get it used up. But it is currently in another project as well, so hopefully that'll um, kick me in the butt to actually use this. All right, okay. next is for N, which is this NYX Total Control Foundation. Um, I have just a little bit left. I believe this is not my shade, so it is a little pale for me, um, even with it being wintertime. Um, this is in the shade Vanilla, so if I ever do get this, um, and the coverage is not really that great. Um, I might have to try to just mix this with another foundation to like lighten it if I have one that's too dark. Um, so yeah, I don't think I would ever repurchase this again. I just want to use this two. guy up. Okay, but no. I do love NYX okay. products. NYX is my favorite like drugstore brand um, to buy from. This. Next is O and it is for Oliver. And this is the bomb from the bomb, and it is a bronzer. So this shade right here, I haven't, I think I maybe swatched it, but I have not used this yet. So I think it might be, it may be a little too dark, but we will see. But I, I got this from an Ipsy bag. Oh, I'm throwing products. Got that from an Ipsy bag. Now I'm at Patchology. This I recently... Not recently. I got this like a couple months ago and just haven't used it. This is the lip um, treatment. It's kind of like a, yeah, gloss to balm treatment. So I'm excited to use this because it is winter time and my lips are have been chapped. So I definitely need to try that out. We are doing this uh, Tarte Blush in Quirky. Yeah. Do you want to open it for me? It. Do you want to open it for me? Yeah. <clears throat> and I have not even touched this blush yet so this is what that looks like and I heard that it is really hard to pan a blush so I want to at least hit pan on this by the end of the year if not use it up because I don't use blush that often um, it's okay. really rare like I do have it on today um, you can probably barely see but um, I rarely use that was one in the Next. Okay. Next is Roller Lashes from Benefit. This is my all-time favorite um, mascara at the moment. So this is my Roller Lashes. So we have for T. This Tree Hut Shea Scrubber, Shea Sugar Scrub. Um, it is in the in the um, scent coconut lime. Coconut. Yeah, if you guys can see that, maybe. So this is what it looks like. Um, that's for T. Okay. U is this Alta Beauty Eye Primer. So I rarely use this anymore because I um, mainly use like concealer or foundation. Um, on my eyes for like an eye primer so I haven't really used this but I just need to use it up to get it out of my collection yeah. 
V is a Vera Wang Embrace um, I got this sample. It. Okay. It's a perfume sample. Yeah. So I think it was already in a project pan because I do have a, like a um, a line on there. If you guys can tell, and I have used probably one time after that. So I just want to yeah, get this used up and try that out. Um, w is the Active Whitening Toothpaste. So I believe my husband bought this um, because he wanted to try to see if this works. He, I think he probably bought it off Amazon or something. Um, but it has been in our uh, cupboard in our bathroom for a while. So, and I believe we've used, he's used like half of it. If not, that's not half. A little, a little more, less than half um, up. So I just want to get this used up and out of our out of our space because I am there's like barely any space in our bathroom for anything anymore. All now right. Next thing is um I got, I got from it. Victoria's Secret. Got, this is the Sexy Cheeks blush. So there's there are five shades in here. So yeah. what I do is I just swirl my brush all around that um to get a good shade for my cheeks. But I have had this four years like I'm it's probably been like five years so I don't know if this performs the same as it used to but I just want to and I don't think Victoria's Secrets even has a makeup line anymore um so I just want to use this up and get it out of my collection Yvonne Quad don't it is not the one in my pa um, project project pan um, it is this top shade. It is soft yellow. You can barely see that. So that kind of looks like a banana powder on the screen, but it's just like a good, it would be a good like, um, transition shade or like if I wanted to brighten up an area. No, my thing. My And then last letter is Z. It is the but Origins Ginseng. I, I, it's this Origins Ginseng Eye Cream. This is like a little sample. I just got this in the Influencers Best in Beauty box. Yo, will be coming soon. Um, hopefully sometime next week. I will. Me and I think Jesso will be in that one. Um, we'll be getting that. Um, there you go. Filmed. But that does it for this intro of my A to Z project pan. Um, I hope you guys had fun watching it. Um, with me and Jessa and this will be monthly updates every month and I hope to see you guys and if I did not mention already this is in collab with the fantastic ladies I will have them linked below um, if you like this video give it a thumbs up also comment down below um, letting me know because a lot of these products you like this video yeah comment down if you like this video also, leave me a comment if you have tried any of these products. Um, a lot of these products are kind of newer to me, um, like the um, what are we what are we doing? The Neutrogena Hydro Boost. That one I've never really used. The Origins I've never really used that. And then the Tree Hut um, Sugar Scrub I've never used that as well. So let me know what um, what products that I'm painting that are, were your favorite. Or if you are doing this project yeah. as well, let me know so I can go check your video out. I love watching them. Um, and I hope to see you guys on our next video. Bye.